Hello friend, now we will see problem 1 sub question 6 which is based on theorem 1, theorem 2, theorem 3 of chapter sequence and series. The question is if 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus going on up to n terms totally divide by 1 into 2 plus 2 into 3 plus 3 into 4 plus going on up to n terms is equal to 0 0.03 then we have to find the value of n the solution is for the terms 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 up to n we write simply summation r r takes value 1 to n then totally divide by for denominator that 1 into 2 plus 2 into 3 plus 3 into 4 up to n terms we write summation r into r plus 1 r takes value 1 to n and that equal to given as a 0 0.03 Then by using theorem 1 for summation r we write n into n plus 1 upon 2 in the numerator then totally divide by in the denominator we have two summations that is summation r takes value 1 to n now r into r we get r square plus another summation that r take value 1 to n now r into 1 we get r and that equal to 0 0.03 therefore the next step will be in the numerator we write n into n plus 1 upon 2 as it is in the denominator by theorem 2 summation r square written as n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 totally divided by 6 and plus for summation r by using theorem 1 we can write it as n into n plus 1 upon 2 and that equal to 0 0.03 again in the numerator that n into n plus 1 upon 2 we write as it is now from denominator we take n n plus 1 upon 2 common from both terms so we have n into n plus 1 upon 2 and then in bracket we left with 2n plus 1 upon 3 plus 1 by 1 bracket complete and that equal to 0 0.03 now we cancel n into n plus 1 upon 2 from numerator and denominator so we have 1 upon then in the denominator we go for cross multiply so we have 2n plus 1 plus 3 whole thing divided by 3 and that equal to 0 0.03 therefore the next step will be 1 upon 2n now 1 plus 3 gives 4 that divide by 3 we get 0 0.03 therefore 3 upon 2n plus 4 is equal to now 0 0.03 can be written as 3 upon 100 so then on cross multiplying that 3 into 2n plus 4 is equal to 3 into 100 Cancelling 3 from both sides, we get 2n plus 4 
is equal to 100 and therefore 2n is equal to 100 minus 4 so 2n is equal to 96 and finally n is equal to 96 upon 2 and therefore n is equal to now 2 1s are 2 2 4s are 8 and 2 8s are 16 so 96 upon 2 we get 48 so finally we get n is equal to 48 so in this way we find the value of n is equal to 48 so this is the required solution for the given problem thank you